third one. There we go. Keep reeling, Augie. Keep reeling. Very nice fish, Augie. I don't even care what happens the rest of the day, do you? I don't even care. It was already an amazing day, right? Bunch of people here again at Tom Slick. Here the day after I saw a couple of pairs. But then I fished for them for a little bit and then they just disappeared on me. So I don't know what happened. You're checking on them, like I said, the next day. That was yesterday, March 31st. Today's April 1st. So I'm hoping I can come over here and find a couple of fish that are locked down to these beds now. Fortunately, like I said, there's a lot of people here. There's a guy right down there. Not too far from those fish right now. So I got to hustle down there. I don't know, they might have already fished past this part actually. Yep, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Don't want to waste a bunch of time like I ended up doing yesterday. I want to give myself more time over at that other pond. Try to find some bigger fish. Here at the next pond again, like I said, looking for a bigger fish. I know there's one that I saw over in that corner yesterday, right as it was getting dark. Not really getting dark, it was dark dark by the time I saw it. So I'm going to get around to that side pretty quick, but I'm going to try and see if I can find a couple of these little guys first, just to get a little warm up here. Yep. Here's a little dude that I found on a bed yesterday that I never caught. I didn't really work on him either, but saw him sitting here while those other guys were over here. There you go. Come on. Jeez. Oh, got him. There we go. Little sucker. Finally got you. Finally got you. Oh, I actually hooked him in the top of the head somehow. Come on, how did that happen? He ate my bait. Oh well. He ended up hooking him in the top of the head, but he definitely ate my bait there, so. I'm gonna count that one as a catch. You can see there's actually a few beds right here. That male right there has been hanging around this outer bed over here. And then there's a really shallow bed here, a really shallow bed here. And then this is the bed where I just got this little male off of. There's a bunch of, a whole bunch of beds right around here. And then that bed's super shallow right there. I don't know if you can see that fish right there or not, but caught that fish yesterday. But it's a really weird thing around here. So far, other than that one good one that I saw right at dark last night, that I'm going to try to go see right now, other than that one, all I've seen is these little tiny guys on a bed. It's really crazy. Even the male that I caught off of that bed yesterday that had the big female in it. 
even he was a really tiny male. I think this fish was right in here. That's part of the problem too. I don't really remember exactly where it was. Oh, there's a bed real shallow right here. Oh, there's a little bass over here to the right. Not even where I was talking about the bed actually. Oh, there's a fish on that bed too though. <laughs> I didn't even see him, but right at my feet. Another fish on that bed. Now that I look at this, this doesn't look right. I don't think this is where that other one was, but let's see if these guys will play real quick. He's right down to my bait. He's not looking very shy. Hmm. He wasn't at first. Now he's circling around, making a big circle. Wow. He just yawned out there, just opened his mouth. Chasing off perch right now. Wow. Bunch of perch, bunch of bluegill hanging out right there. And a smaller bass too. Oh, there he is. Right back on my bait. Oop, oop, got him. Got that little sucker. <laughs> he just ran up there and ate it. All of a sudden, he was not happy with that worm around his bed. <laughs> he was hot from the get-go. Another little male out of this pond. Right there in that really obvious bed, super shallow. I remember now, I saw this bed last night, but I didn't see a fish on it. That doesn't mean he wasn't there. It may have just been too dark to see. Wow. Well, I just can't seem to remember where I saw that fish yesterday, so... I have a feeling it was one of those first two places that I stopped. The fish just aren't there anymore, and that's why I'm not seeing them. Well, let's go to another pond real quick, I think. If I've got time, hopefully this wind doesn't make it impossible to fish. Or sight fish, that is, of course. I'm gonna try to look for some bed and bass around here, but looks like the water's got some color to it. Since I'm in here though, I'm definitely gonna go ahead and fish. I've looked at this place many, many times trying to figure out how to get in here. I haven't been able to until today, like I said, when I just happened to drive by right when that person was leaving. I'm gonna try to look around and find some cleaner water see if maybe back in here a little bit it gets clearer see if I can maybe find some fish on beds and like I said if not then I'll go ahead and switch over to just regular fishing probably put in probably put on some kind of little spinner bait or something well just walking around looking at the place looks like it should be good for bass looks like there should be plenty of bass in here like I said, the water is just way too off color to try to bed fish right now. I have no clue how pressured these fish are. So I'm going to go ahead and just tie on a little moving bait here. I was going to put on a spinner bait or something, but I think this, uh, this little uh, paddle tail swim bait here might actually be a little bit better of a choice. I can throw it more amongst all the brush and stuff. I imagine they're going to be holding pretty close to all that brush along the bank those are good ambush points and good spawning area too there's one there we go nice threw it by that bridge that fish smashed it Decent fish right there. Alrighty. Well, I knew with just the size of the body of water that there was definitely some bass in here, but there's absolute proof right there. Decent little fish. Thank you, buddy. That was fun. Smash that swim bait. <laughs> Oh, 
Ooh, I felt something there. Golly. I might have ate it too, though. I don't know. It was really hard to tell what happened there. Come on, fish. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Oop. Got him. Got him. <laughs>